Hi everyone, welcome to Joan's lab. My name is, well, Joan, and this is my lab, my meth lab. No, I'm kidding. Uh, we actually do serious things here, okay? In this video, I want to tell you guys how I went from doing videos on Salmonella Place, which used to be this channel here, to being one of the co-founders of KenHub, an online anatomy learning platform. So the year was 2011. I was in medical school preparing for my histology exam and for some reason I was not being able to learn in with the old textbook and notes. So I started watching some videos on YouTube and thought what if I could create videos of my own about histology? So I created some very basic histology videos. And when I say basic, I mean basic. They were essentially just a question popping up on the screen and then a few seconds after you would see then the answer. And I no longer have those videos to show you guys but they were super super basic. These videos were not successful but I had a lot of fun creating this type of content and sharing with friends. And after a few weeks I gathered some friends and started creating content together. We called our YouTube channel then Salmonella Place. Okay, I know what you might be asking, why the heck did you call it Salmonella Place? So back in our medical school, there was this dodgy restaurant where we would meet with my friends to then discuss this project. The restaurant was known for putting some people through Salmonella poisonings, okay? But it didn't make us go away. We love the food and poisoning apparently. But to be fair, we were students without much money and the restaurant was right next to the school, so convenience was a factor. Yes, who cares about diarrhea when you can have a cheap, quick meal, right? Every time we would meet, we would say, let's go to Salmonella Place. So when we were trying to pick a name for the channel, one of the <laughs> names that came to our head was like, why not Salmonella Place? It's kind of crazy, it's a bit out there, it's kind of medical, why not? And in the first months, we were able to create our first video tutorials on biology, anatomy, even some vlogs, which believe me, back then, they were not as known as today. Today, you see a lot of vlogs in the medical community, but back then, we were kind of new at this. And the views kind of showed because no one would watch our videos. Only some occasional colleague that would say, please get a life. Then I met my friend Alexandra, who at the time was a dentistry student student in her last years and we instantly clicked. We got together almost every day to create a new video. We continued with the tutorials but branched out to other types of videos uh, where we talked about our experiences in medical school, sharing some advice with our peers. Some of these videos are still in this channel. And this was the time when I started learning a lot about video production. Before I started, I had no idea how to record a video or even edit it. As time went by, I spent a lot of time on YouTube YouTube and on other websites learning how to record and edit videos. Going through my notes, making sure that I don't forget a thing, because I don't want to forget anything. I want to say everything. Now we fast forward to 2012 and I got an email from Ken Hub. It was a very, very basic email saying something like, we like your videos, Let's talk. At the time, Ken Hub was a startup and had a website with the first articles, Atlas sections and quizzes. When I saw the website, I fell in love. And believe me, the website didn't look as cool as it does today. But at the time I thought, this is it. This is a direction I would like to go. And knowing I could bring in videos, I thought would be a match made in heaven. After that email, we worked together on the first videos for KenHub. I remember the first videos we did were on deltoid muscle, the humerus, and the scapula. And that's what I started to learn how it felt to work with the other co-founders at KenHub. My feeling at the time was that I knew that we could go somewhere together. My peers and professors, instructors, they would say, why would I spend so much time on something that is still so new like e-learning? In 2012, explaining to my family that I would teach anatomy online was a little confusing to them and still is, okay? 2012 was only eight years ago, but at the time, only 
online work, especially e-learning, was still something new. And in 2012 was the time where I decided to focus more time on CanHub and take a break from Salmonella Place. At the time, Alexandra graduated and started working as a dentist in the UK. And then came in a very important time, 2013. Halfway through 2013, I joined CanHub as a co-founder. And at that time, I was essentially leading all the content creation that was happening in the platform. I'm talking about from articles to hiring illustrators to video production, it was a lot. But with time, we grew and were able to grow our team as well. Today, I continue working full-time at KenHub, doing what I love the most, which is leading the video production team and the Portuguese side of KenHub as well. To be honest, I never in a million years thought I would be working on video production and medical e-learning, believe me. But as soon as I produced my first video, I knew I wanted to do this forever. Education, medicine, and video production are my passions. And I am so thankful I am able to do what I love every day. I know, it's, it's a fortunate thing. But believe me, against a lot of odds and against a lot of people who thought I was moving in the wrong direction into uncharted territory, and that is how we get to this channel right now, Joan's Lab. I decided to continue this channel as an opportunity to share some of my more personal content, share some of my favorite activities, books, and things I do at KenHub. As I just mentioned before, I love creativity, I love video production. So this channel is my lab, where I can try new things and share them with all of you. Now to learn anatomy, histology, and medical imaging, you can always check what I do at KenHub. There I will be producing new videos as well, but more focused on learning everything about the human body. So many new exciting projects happening at CanHub, believe me, I can't wait to share with you guys. Almost eight years later and we have 1.7 million students at CanHub and growing. It's unbelievable. I honestly cannot wait to see what the future brings to CanHub. And if you're still on the other side, Thank you so much for listening to my story. I know this was a little bit different. I hope I was able to inspire you a little bit to do what you enjoy doing. Maybe even embark on an e-learning journey. Also, I'm going to do what is normally done on these types of video. Please leave a like if you enjoy this type of video so I can produce more videos like these. Also subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any video that I will publish here. Check out all the content that we have at KenHub.com and I will see you next time.